flight, you got it, fight or flight releases a huge burst of cortisol. Cortisol is designed to short circuit linear thinking, okay? Literally to do that because the body does not want you thinking when you see a saber-toothed tiger in front of you. It wants all systems, right Noah? It wants all systems to go straight to the legs and the muscles. Your breathing depresses, sexual urges depress, appetite depresses, your whole body in the sympathetic nervous system goes on hold. And it, there's a moment of pause first where the body, uh, brain assesses, is it actually an emergency? If it's not an emergency, there's a little gap. If it's not an emergency, everything through the parasympathetic nervous system returns to normal. If it is an emergency, then adrenaline knocks the heck out of you and boom, flight, okay, or fight, all right? So the problem for people is some people have a big gap between that, oh, it's okay, right? Some people have none, just about none because of wiring, experience, or whatever. So what happens is the minute the body starts or the, we start perceiving any threat, instantaneously adrenaline kicks in, just about. I mean, you still have the other process, but instantaneously adrenaline kicks in, and then guess what happens? The brain perceives that that is happening, and then it starts becoming afraid of being afraid. And it creates a downward looping spiral. And that's why you couldn't answer questions that you would ordinarily be able to answer. Or, and you kept, regardless of what I would say about putting a question mark, you were unable, you literally were unable at that moment to make a change. Yeah. Okay? Um, do, you, do you understand what I'm saying? Yeah. Yeah. So you've got to know that process operates for you. Okay? And you have got to have steely steely determination to change it, to demand of yourself yeah. to say, no, if you hear yourself say a question mark, you got to say, no, let me say that again. Do you know what I'm saying? It's got to be awareness first of what's going on, and then you must take the bull by the horns. You can make as many mistakes as you want, but you've got to grab it and redo it. Yeah, okay? Yeah. So you did good, you're going to do great in the show, we're going to work, but you must, this is something you must work on because it's present for you. Okay? People can relate, right? All right.